channel update how's it going everyone it's your boy 11 back at it again with another channel update i am so sorry <laughs> now listen the main reason why i'm doing this update is because i was looking at my channel this morning and i noticed that there hasn't been some sort of direction some sort of an update in quite a while actual video that i made was posted over two months ago and the last channel update that i posted was posted over five months ago so yeah we're long overdue for what it is exactly that is going on here so i'm gonna take some time today to break it down for you guys to give you guys a little bit of an update for those that are returning viewers and now that we're over 1000 subscribers which is insane to me i hope to give the new viewers a little bit of an update a little bit of a sense of direction as to what it is that i want to accomplish with this channel and what exactly i am currently doing with this channel so first things first let's address where you're currently watching this video and that is youtube if you're somehow watching on another platform how but anyways like i mentioned i haven't really had any sense of direction with my channel i've been posting just sporadic videos i did a pokemon card opening video i even started a podcast too and so my channel is a little bit of a mixed bag when it comes to the full length content when it comes to shorts however i've been sort of sticking with smash brothers pokemon here and there currently with youtube shorts i have a series going where i rank smash ultimate costumes and shorts have been my bread and butter as of late it has been the thing that has sort of been giving this channel some sort of substance and it is responsible for the entire growth of my channel and honestly i've been loving youtube shorts it's the main reason why i've been so active with youtube shorts is because it allows me to get an idea in my head quickly record it quickly edit it and then just put it on youtube and again it's been super successful and it's been the main reason why my channel has amassed over 1000 subscribers but there's still something missing there's still a piece of the puzzle that is within me that is missing to be completely honest with you the main reason why i haven't really been posting a whole lot of full-fledged videos is just this little dumb voice in my head that always gives me some sense of doubt this little annoying voice in my head always tells me that people are either not gonna like my videos people are not really gonna care about what i'm talking about and this for a while has been the main reason why i haven't really been posting a whole lot of full-fledged content that along with the reason that i also have sort of set these high standards for myself when it comes to videos i always think of an idea i think it'll be fun to do but i always think man that's not such a good idea to do it's not up to par to what i want to do and to be honest that isn't exactly the best mindset to have just due to the fact that having such high standards for myself when i really haven't even created a standard on this channel is not the most healthy thing to do things and so what are we going to do about it well youtube shorts first and foremost are going to remain youtube shorts once again allow me to get an idea in my head and just quickly get it out and honestly with the way that it works and the growth of the channel i definitely do not want to drop youtube shorts i do however want to mix things up and start working on ideas for new series because again i've been doing the whole rating the costumes for smash ultimate thing and while it has been going great and i love doing it i definitely do want to sort of mix it up a little bit and have interweaving series in the youtube shorts and if there's anything nintendo related or just anything in general that you would want me to do with youtube shorts please let me know in the comments below now with full-fledged videos this is sort of going to be tied in with my next topic that i want to address which is streaming now when it comes to the topic of streaming i have been doing literally all my content creation and focusing solely on the platform of youtube streaming on youtube is uh definitely something when i compare youtube streaming to a place like twitch it definitely lacks a lot of the things that i I feel I would want as a streamer. And so when it comes to streaming, I am going to go back to where I previously was for streaming and that is Twitch. I feel like moving to Twitch is going to allow me to just literally do anything and everything that I would want without having to risk messing up my algorithm and messing up my analytics over on my YouTube channel. And while numbers aren't everything, they definitely are something. If I'm going to dedicate my time and efforts into trying to grow my brand and my social media presence, seeing that growth is definitely nice and keeping my algorithm intact keeping the niche that i have on my youtube channel intact is definitely something that i want to preserve but at the same time i have a lot of interests and hobbies and things that i want to explore and i feel like twitch sort of allows me to do that without the consequence of oh you streamed a playstation game instead of a nintendo game 
RIP your channel. And so heading into the summer and going forward, you guys can expect to see me streaming over on Twitch, which I will put a link down below in the description. And also here, a fancy little thing on screen. You can't click it, but trust me, just go to this link. Now, how is this going to benefit the YouTube channel? Well, whenever I do decide to stream something over on Twitch that is fitting to my niche, fitting into what I'm currently doing on my YouTube channel, I'll be turning those moments into stream highlights, taking some of the most entertaining, some of the funnier, some of the more engaging bits and turning them into bite-sized content like YouTube shorts or just stream highlight videos. Whenever I do stream, I always neglect the fact that I am still creating content. It's just on a different format. I'm doing it on a live format. And afterwards, I'm left with a three hour long video essentially that I could trim down, take some of the best moments and just compile it into a short form video. There's a lot that I can do with these streams. And so that's the plan going forward is to take the Twitch content, take some of the best moments and just make a dedicated video about those moments. And at the same time, taking maybe individual moments, some of those funny, some of those suspenseful ones and putting them into short form content on YouTube shorts, TikTok, and even Instagram. That being said, there is still a lot of ideas that I've been sort of toying around with. I even got a notepad and started jotting down some of those ideas. And now more than ever, as we are getting into the summer, I really want to make some of those ideas come through to fruition and actually see what exactly happens when I actually make it happen. So I covered YouTube. I even covered Twitch but where else can you find me for the longest time i feel like i've been neglecting other avenues of content i feel like as a content creator putting your eggs into one basket and that basket for me has been youtube for the past couple of months and while the growth of this channel definitely has exceeded all my personal expectations there is other social media platforms that i have neglected over the years tiktok being one of them and yes i know tiktok is on a very dicey spot right now just due to it potentially getting banned uh within the next year or so but regardless it's still there and it is definitely a platform that i really want to explore and actually started exploring at the beginning of this week at the beginning of this week i made a brand new tiktok account and i have been posting the ranking smash brothers ultimate costume series youtube shorts on tiktok and they have been doing absolutely amazing just this week alone i've been able to hit over 200 followers on that new tiktok account and it's been definitely something that has been really eye-opening and really motivating me to just continue doing what it is that i'm doing on that account and to bring live streaming back into the conversation i definitely want to explore live streaming on tiktok as well and so if you're interested in checking out my short form content on tiktok and seeing what i got going on maybe posting some exclusive things that i won't be posting here you could go ahead and find the link down below in the description or just look up this at on the screen on tiktok another place that i'm exploring is instagram and again similar to tiktok i have been posting the same series over there in uh, instagram reel format and i might even start posting behind the scenes pictures of what i got going on maybe whenever i go out on a trip whenever i see something nerdy or whenever i just want to post a random meme or a picture of my cats and again everything for instagram is here on the screen or down below in the description all that being said a little bit of a tldr for those of you that are just scrolling don't care just want to know what the video is about first youtube shorts are not going anywhere they are my bread and butter at this point again if you guys have any ideas for youtube short series that involve nintendo franchises smash brothers ultimate please let me know and i'll try to see what i can do when it comes to streaming you guys could find me over on twitch.tv forward slash 11 is okay and i will be doing variety content along with some of the content that i was already doing here like smash brothers ultimate and nintendo stuff long form content is going to be composed of stream highlights ideas that i have suggestions from viewers and also addressing some of the more interesting topics that have to do with communities such as smash brothers ultimate and just communities that i'm interested in making videos about you can also find me in other platforms such as tiktok and instagram again links down below in the description for those platforms i will be trying to do exclusive content such as posting pictures on instagram doing exclusive streams over on tiktok so please make sure to stay tuned for those as well one thing that i didn't mention at the beginning is that for the past two years i've been doing a lot of esports stuff and i feel like that's another reason why i sort of deviated from focusing on my own personal brand and instead trying to help out esports teams while also running one of my own and nothing within esports for me is going to really change if anything i'm going to take the roles that i currently have with the teams that i am helping and sort of try to amplify it and do the best that I can with them. I'm doing this in the hopes that I could potentially build up my experience, build up a very solid resume that I could shoot in the way of potentially any big team that I am interested in for a bigger opportunity. But that's going to do it for me. To anybody that is watching, please make sure to subscribe as the content will ramp up. Once again, I'm going to do my best to just try to post in as many places as possible. And if you're one of the newer subscribers, I really do appreciate you guys subscribing, tuning into the YouTube shorts. I know a lot of you come from
come from them thank you guys so much for coming through my name is 11 have yourselves a damn good one please remember that you guys are beautiful you guys are amazing don't let anybody tell you otherwise bye